what a night. Can you sum up how you're feeling? Overwhelmed. Um, ever, I'm in shock, I think. Um, you know, you don't play sport or you don't do the training for, you know, the accolades. And I think, um, like I said, I think it's really hard to separate a player from a team. Um, and it's really, I accept this on behalf of all my teammates, um, the other players that, you know, we do it together. How special is it to win the inaugural Dame Lois Muir Supreme Award? Hugely special. I think um, yeah, Dame Lois is a legend. Um, and I think, yeah, like I said, if, you, if I can give back half as much as she has to our game, um, you know, that's, that's a real measure of success. I think she's given so much and she continues to do so. Um, and if I can look as fit and strong as she is at her age, um, I think that's a good sign also. You've also been crowned the Silver Ferns Player of the Year. Out of all the internationals you've played this year, is there one that stands out for you? Uh, yeah, although we lost the final at World Cup, I thought that game really stood out. It was fast and furious and um, the way that our team bounced back from a horrendous start, I, short, I thought shows the heart that our group has. Um, so that really stood out and I thought even though we lost at that point in time, I knew this group had good things and it, even better things were meant to come for us. So I think it's weird to say a losing game stood out, but that was a really turning, a big turning point I felt. How does it feel to pull on the black dress every time before you step out on court? Um, oh, yeah, when you pull on the back black dress um, and you're named in a starting lineup, you know you've earned it. Um, I think, you know, when you're doing your trainings over summer or it's a frosty winter and you've got to get out and train, you just have to think of the honour of wearing the black dress um, to get you out the door. Uh, there's no better feeling than warming up for a test match um, and that's when you see the little kids playing on a Saturday um, or you see uh, the New Zealand secondary schools that play before our ANZ games you know they aspire and they want to wear the black dress as much as you are and it's a truly great inspiration. How important are nights like this for netball in New Zealand? Oh, I think nights like this, it's incredible. I think it's so wonderful that we have a female or we're recognising um, women's sport. Um, I think it really does show how much growth netball has had over the years, that uh, we've got to a point um, in our professionalism that we can have awards. Um, and I think it's wonderful and a sign of how big we're going to get. And finally, is there anyone you'd like to thank tonight? Yeah, actually, someone I did miss out was uh, my work, Deloitte. Um, gosh, they've let me come and go for the past um, couple of years um, whilst giving me work experience for the other um, side of my life and that's something I'll be very grateful for. But like I mentioned um, on stage, it's the support network. I get to do the journey, but man, it's the team behind the team that really keeps you going. And I've been very lucky from a very young age. I had a fantastic team behind me who have made this journey possible.